there, I wanted to do a wax cutting video. This is a loaf of Fruit Loops. Um, it also has some lemon lime fizzy soda in it. And I wanted to kind of show you guys because we've had a lot of questions about how you cut your wax loaves and uh, what the whole process is like. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and go into this pretty quickly because we just microwaved this. Um, for this specific kind, because it's a little bit higher in the soy quantity, um, we did 30 seconds just on wax paper like this. And then we did 30 se seconds more on the side because it was still needing a little bit more. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this. Um, and I actually made it so that I could make slices of this um, because I'm gonna be selling this in slices. So basically, you're gonna notice that this cuts just like butter. Yay! Look at that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm using a serrated knife. This is literally just a miracle blade. Um, you can buy specific soap cutters that have the ridges as well if you like the ridges. Um, I've tried to do flat knives before and having these serrated parts does make a huge difference. So I would definitely um, go with something that has a serrated edge or the curvy soap cutting edge. So again, you just kind of cut and you can cut into smaller chunks for yourself, obviously. That one kind of came apart because these loaves, they do have um, layers. So, I mean, that's obviously something that comes with the territory. Going right here. But you'll see that it cuts just like butter. Like, I mean, obviously also, look at these chunks in there. This has fruit, um, fruit Loops inside the chunks. Inside here, you're also going to get um, the Lemon Lime Fizzy Soda and then also the Sugar Waffle Cone. Right now, I am smelling just an amazing amazing scent of the sugar waffle cone it's really coming out it smells so 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 good so um here's another little chunky this is a little ice cream cone right here so once you've microwaved it you do have you know a good couple of minutes before it gets um cooled down again so but i would go ahead and move kind of quickly once you've done it and microwaving it does not take the scent out. People do wonder, like, oh no, you microwave it. But you don't microwave it enough to melt it. You just soften it. So it's just like butter. It feels like butter. It cuts like butter. Um, the reason that's coming apart is going to be because it has those little chunks in there. Um, so those were some of that amazing, like you can see that in there. Oh, it smells so good. You're going to love this. So this is a little chill pill. I'll show you. I'll kind of knock that off there. Yummy. Um, but yeah, these smell utterly amazing. So we're going to have these um, these beautiful loaf chunks for sale tonight at our sale. Um, and so anyway, it's not a sale, but we're, we're selling things. So, <laughs> okay. Just wanted to show you guys how to cut um, these loaves. And if you have any questions, feel free to post them and I will do my best to answer them. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.